This morning, we now know the name of the man who was shot and killed inside the Steak and Shake on South Boulevard. The family of Darnell Harris says he died trying to protect his co-workers when those shots rang out. Wake up Charlotte's Billie Jean Shaw is live at the scene. Billie Jean family members say they're not surprised Harris stepped in to help. Good morning, Robin Carolyn. Yeah, we spoke to Darnell Harris's family just a few hours ago, and in a statement, they say they're not surprised that Darnell stepped in to save others because that's just who he was. This all started yesterday inside of the Steak and Shake on South Boulevard around 1130 yesterday, and then it spilled out over into the parking lot where a shootout happened. Our police police sources have confirmed that the suspected gunman is 30 year old. Eddie Doe. Now, police say he shot a customer and an employee who we now know as Darnell Harris. Mecklenburg County EMS confirming, confirming Harris died at the scene. Overnight, his family sending us this picture. His co-workers say Harris died protecting them. But it is a travesty. I know that he was protecting a lot of the, the uh, associates. It's hurtful. It hit too close to home. You know, my kids have grown up knowing Steak and Shake and everybody in it. Even my kids are hurt. Such a tragic situation. We've been seeing all types of posts on social media as well as people are just hurt by what happened. As you heard that employee mention, such a small knit community inside of the Steak and Shake here. And as far as the suspected gunman, Eddie Doe, police say that he is in critical condition after being shot by responding officers yesterday. Those two officers are now on paid administrative leave, which is standard procedure in these types of incidents. But coming up at 5.30, We'll have much more on Doe's criminal past. Reporting live in South Charlotte, Billie Jean Shaw, Wake Up Charlotte.